I think we passed these around earlier. These are a special jaw type. And one side will have the letters on it, the other side will not. It's just like the, the other crimp tool with the, the colored dots. Always insert your wire into the side that has the label on it, whether it's a colored dot or a letter or a number, okay? And that's, if you haven't noticed that, that's consistent across all uh, crimp tools. Get it? Because what they have is when you close these down and pick one of these letters, and you'll see that the letter side has a larger opening than its corresponding non-lettered side. Because what you're going to have here, and I need to pull up a couple of pictures, we're going to do a double crimp, just like we did with the insulated crimpers. This is a, an exploded view of what you want to have at the end. A lot of these have locking tabs that are vertical. This one does not actually, okay? This one, this isn't this way. If you look, it, it, it's right at the edge of those spring-loaded gold connect contactors. So you just want to make sure you don't crimp that. You're only crimping these two pieces here, which if you look, one crimps the inner crimp, which is the smaller one, crimps the conductor itself. So you got to strip the wire the right length, all right? And then the outer one grips the insulation. 